Hi, friends from around the world. Uh, if you are interested in business, if you are in business, if you are uh, in a startup, if you want to make business, then this channel is most likely for you. If you are interested in IP, and if you are an IP lawyer, uh, if you are IP student, uh, this channel has content for you uh, very uh, much relevant. So this is now 100 videos I have made uh, of content, hopefully uh, of content which serves you. I, uh, the, uh, the service, the uh, intention of the channel is to serve you, to bring you to a higher level, to enhance your knowledge about your business, to thrive your business uh, together with the IP portfolio, to explain IP portfolio, to give you a possibility to talk to the lawyers, you business people, to talk to the lawyers about IP, about IP strategy, to think about an IP strategy on your own, to explain it to the uh, lawyers, to bring the IP department on your level. Well, that is all uh, what uh, this channel is about. So this is coming from my heart. This is free content, so far free content. And I want to serve you to from my heart and to bring you to a level where you can understand the value of IP. You know already that uh, in many companies the IP portfolio makes up 70% of the uh, balance sheet. So that is an important issue to take care about. Now, my, uh, my first <clears throat> approach is uh, that for business you need, uh, you need a unit of account, so uh, money, so to say, and you need IP in order to thrive your business, to drive your business to a next level, to scale up your business, right? Now, in order to... Uh, to do this, you need uh, the uh, trust of the consumer because uh, the consumer will not buy your product, will not buy your service if it hasn't trust, right? So IP is about uh, building a bridge between you, the company, uh, the delivering company and uh, the individual, the consumers, maybe a company as well. So, But uh, still, you need trust. <laughs> so that trust... Uh, how do you how do you build it? Well, if you want to trust in the name, uh, you need trademark. If you want to build trust uh, in the uh, the attractiveness of the design, you need a, a design. If you need uh, build trust in the innovation of uh, the uh, product, so the the novelty, uh, the inventive step, you know, you need a patent. If you want to build trust in the in the quality of the food you're offering and the process of the food and the ingredients etc well guess what you need a, a, gen a geographical indication so uh, these are uh, about trust and it's about standards so uh, think about standards if you want a globalized world you want uh, some standards in order to understand what is what I am buying from, I don't know what country it is, China, probably 80% come from China. So uh, this is uh, an, a necessary step for the consumers to repeat a positive experience, a positive experience from one buy, right? It bought one, it was very satisfied with the, so I want another. So how do we refer to it? Well, this is, here's the name, for example, of the trademark, okay? Coca-Cola. Okay. So <clears throat> to explain it better, let us have a look. How would the world look like without IP? So how would you how would you trust a new that a product is new uh, on mere advertisement? Or how would you uh, trust that a food is very good? It has a high price. Is that okay? Or on the on the mm, I don't know on the label would you would you uh, think the label is sufficient without control that this is a high quality uh, product food product 
or uh, how would you uh, trust the company who is uh, delivering, who is on the label, uh, that this is a good company or that that company makes good products? Is it the name? Is it is it uh, the label? Is it uh, how how would you trust it? And you may even not uh, uh, not understand that uh, that label in the in the right way. So these are uh, things uh, where you think well, uh, it is good to have some standards around the world, <clears throat> and we have that standard around the world, a minimum standard. It's called the TRIPS Agreement. Uh, trade-related intellectual property uh, agreement. So uh, this is 1994. And uh, well, I will... Okay. So the channel is about business, right? So I want to talk uh, to business people and I want interested business people into IP. That is uh, the first level. I've put 100 videos here uh, for free content so far online. So... I put it in different levels so that you can find yourself and find uh, the content which would be interested for you. I have different lists and the lists have a certain level attributed. So the first level is for uh, business people for uh, who have some interest in IT, who want to make uh, IP an important part of their balance sheet, of their company. Uh, they want uh, to establish a kind of IP strategy. Uh, that would be uh, level one. IP students are there as well, and IP lawyers in order to have uh, a bit more business perspective in order to serve at a higher level their consumers. That would be also interested people. Uh, so from around the world, namely the first level from around the world, meaning uh, non-Europeans, because it is focused on European IP. So those who want to make uh, business uh, within Europe, which is one of the first places uh, in the world where you should think of in making business. So that is the first level. Second level uh, would be uh, for uh, those uh, who have more interest in uh, special IP knowledge. So uh, they would go, uh, go a step further in different uh, in, in the different uh, IP laws which you have, etc. So that would be uh, for uh, IP lawyers from around the world, business people also who would go further for their understanding. Level three, uh, that is about uh, um, that is about I would say uh, IP lawyers, IP lawyers from around the world and IP lawyers from Europe. That is not already uh, in conception, right? That will come will come along the years, and uh, this will uh, give you an update on what would be the uh, the case law important case law on intellectual property in Europe. So that would be obviously for IP lawyers from around the world and from Europe who would get uh, an immediate uh, update, so on a yearly basis, on what has been the important case law with regards to intellectual property. And then I have, I'm um, thinking about a fourth level uh, that would be for, uh, for specialist uh, business people, uh, specialist uh, lawyers, uh, accountant, uh, IP lawyers, etc., that would go uh, uh, into depth with regard to building an IP strategy and monetization of their IP in order to make uh, IP the central role, a revenue stream, to build a revenue stream of your IP into the company. So you think probably in the beginning that IP is a cost issue. I have to pay for the patent. I have to pay for the trademarks. I have to renew it. And uh, I have to in this uh, jurisdiction and in that jurisdiction. And that is, uh, well, uh, this is not uh, the ultimate uh, thinking of what is, uh, that is a merely defense instrument, but it could be also an instrument, a positive instrument to create revenue for the company and rely on it. So that is uh, what the, uh, the channel is about. It is not about technicalities in principle. So it is uh, as the business and IP, so the business first 
and IP on top of it in order to get it. So there is one part of the mindset. Uh, I think it is an important issue as well for you business people to get the right mindset, namely for those startups, for those small businesses from around the world, uh, where you go through different steps in order to uh, to get to a level where well you are thriving but the mindset the mindset you need to build up the muscles the intellectual muscles you need to set up in order to go through all this through all the adversities and there are a lot of them and you may be your first enemy within your head with regard to your future success you may be very close to success and then you quit <laughs> so that happens often and this is the mindset so uh, welcome to uh, the channel uh, if you have interest in business and ip you are at the right place go for it Go as long as it is free content. Enjoy.